HP reached out to sponsor a showcase of their new Elite books. So I've got the 14 inch 1040 G4 and the 12 and a half inch X360 1020 G2 here. These are both ultra slim business notebooks, each of them with three, yes, three discreet hardware enforced security features to keep your computer secure no matter where you're working. And this is probably the coolest one. Toggleable privacy filter? What? Most of the time, you'll want the full experience of the EliteBook's glossy 4K IPS touchscreen. But what about situations where you don't want looky loos spying over your shoulder, or you actually can't let others see the sensitive information on your screen, like when you're trying to get some real work done on a plane? Sureview is HP's name for their built-in privacy screen that you can toggle with a one-button click. This is so... Cool. Sureview combines a 3M light control film on the screen with a proprietary backlight behind it. So when Sureview is off, the backlight uses two light sources to disperse light across all areas of the display. When it's on, however, the backlight only uses one light source and it focuses it through the light control film in a narrow 70 degree cone, reducing up to 95% of the light that's being emitted outside of your privacy zone. It doesn't block off axis viewing to quite the same degree as a standalone external filter, and it does cut down on the vertical viewing angles a little bit, even when it's disabled, but from our experience, it is more than good enough. It doesn't add any extra bulk to this super slim notebook. The ability to toggle it on and off is freaking awesome. And it can even have the added benefit of increasing battery life by up to 15%, depending on how long you keep it on. All right, let's move on to attackers that aren't sitting in the same room. Unsecure web browsing is one of the most common attack vectors for malware, as innocent employees or even woke IT buffs like you and I can easily download malicious malware or ransomware if we haven't had our morning coffee yet. To combat this, HP has worked closely with Bromium on a feature that they call SureClick, which is designed to shift the cybersecurity responsibility from the bright-eyed internet user to the PC itself. Whenever you visit a website, SureClick isolates the browsing session inside of a micro virtual machine, which eliminates the ability of that one site to infect the system or even other browser tabs. If a piece of malware attacks a browsing session, it simply goes away once the infected tab is closed. It all works through the SureClick browser, which currently supports both Internet Explorer and Chromium without adding any extra baloney. But you can also check out some vital stats through the SureClick console, including how many pages have been safely opened and how many micro VMs are instantiated at that moment. Moving on, let's look at the last line of defense, our third security feature here. It's a below the OS protocol called HP Sure Start, which I personally would have called Sure Boot because it Daddy? kicks out any foreign code that might have made its Daddy? way into your machine's BIOS. Built into a custom hardware chip on the system board, SureStart will cryptographically verify the integrity of the HP BIOS code before the CPU is allowed to execute even the first line. If the system detects that the BIOS has been altered from a malicious attack or an accidental error or whatever, the embedded controller will replace the BIOS with a new copy that's stored in a secret memory that can't be accessed by third-party software or malware, or even third-party firmware. Okay, but hold on a second, Linus. I don't really restart my computer that often. My BIOS could be infected for days or weeks before SureStart fixes it. Ah, no. So this latest third generation of SureStart has runtime intrusion detection, meaning it will continually verify that a genuine HP system BIOS is present in the system flash, and if tampering is detected, it will automatically restore the BIOS oh, no while the system is running. But even with all these hardcore security features, there's no extra bulk on these notebooks. 
They're just over half an inch at their thickest and are very light despite all the goodies inside. So ours rock Core i7 7600U processors, 16 gigs of RAM, and a one terabyte NVMe SSD with HDMI output and dual Thunderbolt 3 ports. The X360 even comes with a stylus if you wanna get your art on or more likely in my case, jot down some chicken scratch notes and diagrams. Not too shabby. The 1040G4 and the X360 1020G2 both start at $1399, so be sure to check them and all their hardware enforced features out at the link below. Thanks for watching guys. Thanks to HP for sponsoring this video. If you disliked it, you can hit that button, but if you liked it, hit like, get subscribed, or maybe consider checking out where to buy the stuff we featured at the links in the video description. Also down there is our merch store, which has cool shirts like this one and our community forum, which you should totally join.